In the medieval period, the artwork in churches was intended to teach and explain the faith to the people. In keeping with that tradition, we brought together a variety of experts with insight about these eight Marian stained glass windows. I think the very interesting thing about our series, and it's, it'll be really helpful for people, that although we did film the stained glass windows in small, we've traveled almost to every location that we could uh, to match the stained glass window with the church. Like right now, we're outside of Our Lady of Soros Basilica, and we do have a stained glass window to match in small. The symbol of red, the symbol of sorrow, of pain, of, of suffering, uh, is very apropos. Our statue here is in traditional Mary blue, but the two things that distinguish them, in our statue, we just have a sword piercing her heart. And then in later years, Mary has the image of seven swords, which mean, which is designates the seven sorrows of Mary. We actually traveled not only in Chicago area, we were able to film some churches in uh, Lincoln, Nebraska, and San Francisco, California. Two paintings, five apparitions, and a spiritual devotion. Each version of Mary represents a different spiritual devotion to the Blessed Mother practiced by Catholics for many centuries. So as an editor in this mini-series, there's lots of things that goes on behind the scenes that people don't realize it's all involved here. Uh, one thing would be the color correction. Basically, that fixes issues with the color of the footage, so it matches how the human eye perceives certain hues and tones. He took care of her, he will take care of them. They had remained faithful to God, they had remained faithful to their church throughout all these travesties they experienced. And she's telling the Irish, carry on. Another important part of the post-production process that goes largely unnoticed is the sound. Um, making sure to record and edit and import everything correctly is one of the most crucial parts to a project like this. Because if something sounds drastically different, even if it's just a clip from everything that's around it, it breaks the immersion. This is how St. Mary of the Woods was founded. Originally established in 1952 on account of... And so after you edit it and make sure that you have the right files in there so that you can easily tell what's background, what's foreground and everything. Originally established in 1952 on a... And especially for something that's educational like this is, you don't want that sort of distraction breaking the immersion because that can really affect how much audiences can walk away with at the end. Whether we're in the south of France or whether, whether right here in Chicago, that we're invited to participate in the mission of evangelization. Because people weren't really praying the rosary in those days. And what did God say? He sent his mother to help us, huh? He sent his mother to help us. <laughs>